Welcome, in front of me is a Techno Spark 20C and today I will show you how you can hard reset this device through recovery mode. Now with that being said, doing such a reset will also allow you to get rid of a screen lock if you have one set that you don't know. So when I like the device you can see I do have a pattern. Now. On top of that, when doing such a thing to remove screen lock, you will most likely end up with the device being FRP locked. So what that entails is that when reset is finished and you're going through the setup of the device, you'll be forced to verify either the previously used screen lock that was on this device or Google account that was signed in prior to the reset. So those would be, you can obviously utilize one of those to unlock the device. Now. There is a way to bypass this without verifying either one of those, which I'll be recording in a separate video for people that might be interested in it for whatever reason. But in any case, uh, jumping to the actual reset, uh, we're gonna first turn off our device. So we can do that from the lock screen without even providing a screen lock. You can see this will obviously turn off the device. Once that is the case, meaning the device is completely off, hold your power button and volume up at the same time. And after a moment, once you see the Techno logo on a display, you want to let go of the power button, but keep holding volume up. After a couple more seconds, we should have, there we go, the Android visible with no command written under it. Once that is the case, hold the power button, press volume up once, and this will redirect you to the recovery mode. And here, utilizing volume buttons, either volume down or up, depending on if you want to navigate up or down, you want to select Wipe Data Factory Reset. Once it's selected, confirm it with the power button. Select Factory Data Reset. As you can see, it will tell you that it's formatting data and then Data Wipe Complete, at which point Reboot System Now is selected by default. So press power button once again, and this will now continue the resetting of the device in the background. And once that is finished, we'll be presented with Android Setup Screen. So I'll be back once that is visible for me. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So with that being said, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.